Okay, so from the last video, we had a look at how to create and use anonymous functions, okay? So in today's video, we're gonna see how to access um, variables outside of that anonymous function. So let me show you what I mean, okay? So let's say we had some variable here outside um, this function, and it's called some random variable, and it has the number 45 in it. So how do we access this um, some random variable inside this anonymous function here. Let's just try to echo this um, anonymous function. Um, let's say inside there some random variable. Okay, so let me just delete this. So let's go back in the browser and see what, we, what happens. I refresh this, as you can see, we have an error. So basically what's happening is that um, this fun anonymous function here does not have access to any variable outside of its scope. So anything inside that you declare here, if I had to create some variable here, let's say A, then it has access to it. But if I put A outside here, then that anonymous function does not have access to A. But PHP um, provides something called use for you, which you can say, okay, I want to use these um, variables which are outside of my scope, so I won't have access to them. So inside of the use function there, or keyword, you can pass in whichever variable you need access to. In this case, some random variable. Okay, so now when we do this, um, this here should work, this echo statement. So let's refresh this browser and this error should go away. Okay, so that happens. Okay, so that's how you use the use keyword to have access to external variables inside your anonymous functions. Okay, so there is another keyword called global which is used to access um, functions inside regular functions, in, which is used to access variables inside regular functions, okay? So in the next video, we're gonna have a look at that. So um, as usual, thanks for watching. I will see you soon. Bye-bye.